just between me and you, you guys, I go take this test and I will be right back. Some of you have been guessing. guessing in the comments. One person did like some Jedi thing <laughs> and was like, oh my God, really? Yeah. And Candace was like, wink. And yeah. she's like, ah. Oh. Yeah. And it's like, what the? <laughs> yeah. It's so crazy. I'm like, I really feel like you guys like cool. love me and know me. So thank you so much. That so awesome. yeah. Currently, 19 weeks today. When this video goes up, I might be 20. We'll see. But I'm like basically at the halfway mark, which is crazy. Um, the, really? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Only 20 more weeks or less. <laughs> yeah. I'll have my degree. Wow. I'll have my degree, I think. Really? I think so. Wow. So we have one and a half wow. children right now. For those of you that just clicked on this video and you don't know anything about us, we used to live in New York City, but we moved to Dallas in January. We have a 21 month old girl. Her name is Luna. Let's get into the meat and potatoes of why we are here and how we want to share this great news with you. So um, I basically found out that I was pregnant um, really early. I feel like this, even with my first pregnancy, like I found out literally like the day after that I like could take the test. I feel like my symptoms have been a lot different and I'm going to do like another video on like comparing my pregnancies or whatever, but um, I decided to take the test because one, I was waking up like really fatigued and tired and... You would wake up with like morning sickness too? Yeah, like morning sickness in my first pregnancy, like I had no morning mm -hmm. sickness whatsoever. So I was like, that's weird. Obviously at the time you don't know it's morning sickness. Like I just thought I was like sick or yeah. fatigued. I also had this weird symptom where every time I would lean down to pick up a toy or like pick up or tie my shoe, like I would feel super lightheaded. When you got up when I got up so I think that was like a symptom of low blood pressure or something yeah. which is kind of a mismatch for me because I'm pretty like active and healthy so I ended up um, talking to my sister one day and I was like telling her these symptoms and I was like kind of joking around and she was like wait that like low blood pressure thing is like the number one symptom for me like <laughs> finding out that I'm pregnant like all my pregnancy so Big question, like, were we trying or were we not trying? We weren't trying, trying but we were trying, <laughs> if you think about we weren't, it. We weren't not trying. <laughs> surprised, but it wasn't a surprise. You know you what I'm know? saying? The day that I decided to take the pregnancy test and I found out 
his mom was actually visiting us. She lives in New York, but she was visiting us here in Dallas. And we had taken her out to dinner. And I remember we went out to dinner and we're not huge drinkers anyway, but like if we go out to a nice dinner, like we'll drink like a glass or two, right, of yeah. something. But for whatever reason that day, like something, like a little voice in my head was like, just don't get alcohol, you know? And not like that's very unlike me, but I remember distinctly being like, mm, that doesn't sound really good. So I don't know. I don't know if other like pregnant people that's happened to you or not, but I decided. It's like your body was talking to you. Yeah. Don't do it. Exactly. Like listen to your intuition. I decided that night I was going to take the test because I had bought the test out and I wasn't going to tell anyone because I didn't really think it was going to be positive. But I did decide to record it because I never recorded me finding out about my first pregnancy. Like I hadn't even started my YouTube channel then. So I was like, it would be really cute if I like recorded it. But I truly did not think it was going to be positive. We were back home at my parents' house and I, like nobody knew. Everyone was downstairs. I was upstairs like being sneaky. <laughs> and I was like, I would just take this and get it out of the way. And as you will see, I was very shocked. She looks like she was a boxer getting ready for a fight. <laughs> <laughs> yes, like all kinds of emotions. Like my adrenaline, I was like... Ooh, I think I like paced the bathroom back and forth. First of all, just waiting for like the test to show negative or positive. I feel like I was so nervous. And also I feel really blessed because I know a lot of times like people, like I'm sending love to people that like really try for pregnancy yeah. and they're not able to. Like we're so fortunate, like that hasn't really happened to us. So honestly, the first time I guess we were trying. <laughs> we were not while. trying. <laughs> yeah, the first time it took a while. Yeah, it took a while. It took a while. Um, so. But we weren't trying, trying. So it was like, but we were not, not trying in the sense that we were like, this can happen, and we were like, okay. Right. So. Right. So. But we were about to get like concerned. Yeah. Well, yeah, and I think it had to do with like. Um, me being on birth control, but that's like a whole other video that yeah. if you're watching this and you don't want to talk about that, we can skip over that. Mm -hmm. But if you have a hard time like conceiving, like much love, sending love out to you. For me, like the first time I was very super regular. So as soon as I had my missed period, I knew that I was pregnant. Like literally the test was not even like, it was like a confirmation, but I already knew. Yeah. This time also, like I took one test and it said positive and it was a very strong line. So. I like knew right away. I did take like three more in the next two days just because, but I like knew. So without further ado, let me just roll the clip. You guys can watch it and then we'll <laughs> see you guys back here on the couch. Like it. <laughs> Hello you guys. Um, so we are back home and uh, so honestly, I don't know if this clip is going to ever make it into a vlog. If it does, it will be crazy. But just got back from dinner with my mother-in-law and my husband. My daughter stayed at home with my parents. They looked after her so that we could have a nice dinner. We had the most amazing barbecue. Um, but just between me and you, you guys, I have told nobody this yet except for my sister. I am a couple days late and although we are not like actively trying there is a possibility that there could be a pregnancy so I'm just gonna take a test just to be safe I've also um, heard that taking the vaccine has been like changing women's menstrual cycles up a little bit so even though I'm not super consistent um, my little app or track or whatever does say that I should have gotten it by now and I don't feel like I feel a little different I have some other symptoms so like I'm getting really out of breath really easily I've been having like low blood pressure symptoms because every time that I bend down and stand back up I get like a little lightheaded which doesn't make sense for me because I'm very active and I work out all the time um, and then I also have been having like period cramps but with no actual period so doesn't hurt to take a test and if I find out right now you guys will be the first to know believe it or not and then this will be crazy because it's just a Thursday night nothing crazy I just got back from dinner so I'm gonna go into my little bag here and I think I have so I have my first pregnancy test which is crazy it still has a line from 
me see why won't this focus there we go so this is my first pregnancy test from my daughter that I still have still has two very solid lines and then I have this unopened one that I'm going to use and I honestly don't remember how long you're supposed to wait but I think because I don't have the directions anymore for this I wonder if the directions are on this Just let me take off my jacket of course I'm wearing literally a bodysuit which is like <laughs> so inconvenient all right guys so I just changed Everyone is downstairs. They have no idea what I'm doing up here, so I'm gonna go take this test and I will be right back. Okay, you guys, so I'm putting on a timer. I don't know how long. Okay, I read it wrong. Okay, it's not done yet. I'm putting on a timer. I'm not gonna look at it for like. Let's say, um, what is it, like three minutes? I'm not going to look at it for three minutes. And then we're going to find out what it says. So I was just shocked for a second because I looked at it and I thought it was supposed to be like two lines meant pregnant, but it has to be like a cross and a line or something like that. So I'm just going to wait. I'm not going to look at it. So if it does say positive, you guys, which I doubt it will, but I don't know how else to explain these symptoms and a late period. <clears throat> Anyways, I really like how my makeup turned out. My skin's been looking great with this collagen, liquid collagen that I've been drinking, so highly recommend. Is this supposed to be three minutes? I have no idea, actually. I feel like to be safe, I could do five minutes, but I feel like I can't wait five minutes. <laughs> well, I'm so nervous. <laughs> Let's take a look. guys oh my god oh my god oh my god Oh my god, I'm this is literally surreal. I cannot even Oh my god. Oh my god. Gosh. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. I knew it. I knew it. Oh my gosh. I literally have no words right now. Okay. I literally have to stop filming right now, you guys, and come back to you later. So that was the clip of me finding out. It was obviously longer, but I had to cut it down for the sake of time. And now we get to watch me telling Joelle that we are pregnant. So after I found out, I was like, oh, I want to do something really cute this time. Like, I'm going to plan it out and be elaborate, but, like, I'm the worst at holding things in. So, literally, like, 20 minutes later, I was like, ah! Like, really? <laughs> so... Can't hold any secret. Can't hold a single secret, and definitely not this one. So, what I decided to do is, at the time, I had ironically just bought an Ancestry DNA test from 23andMe. And you guys also might have seen that video so this is like how long ago we're talking because 
Like now we're halfway through the pregnancy. Yeah. So. I ordered the Ancestry DNA test and I had the box. So I was like, let me just pretend that I got the results from my Ancestry DNA test and then have him like open it up with me, but it be like the positive pregnancy test. And I was like, he's never going to fall for that. Like that's going to be so corny. And yet... <laughs> <laughs> well, I was like, when when you did it, I was like, what? Why are you showing me something of you? And why are you recording me? But then it was like, what can be the surprise to me? Like, are you Dominican? <laughs> like, I'm like, what are you? And then... Finding right, out I'm Dominican is the name of this yeah, thing. Yeah, <laughs> I'm like, And then as I'm about to open it, I'm saying, she's probably pregnant. There's a, probably a pregnancy test. <laughs> and I'm like... Uh, and sure and enough... <gasps> Did you actually look at it to see if it said positive or did you just believe it I just positive? believed yeah. that it said positive because I'm like, it's a pregnancy test yeah. unless it's a prank. I'm like, you're not that cruel <laughs> to prank me yeah, like that. Yeah, that would be crazy. It was just, like I said, like thrown together, but I'm glad I did record it and I'm going to put it in for you guys to watch right now. I know they care. Okay, let's open it and see the results. Yeah. Open it for me. I don't know why I'm scared. There's nothing. There. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> okay, so this says you're pregnant? <laughs> yes. You're pregnant? Yeah. We're done. <laughs> oh, my oh my god. Are you sure? Uh, yes. So now I can tell you Hold the whole up. entire story. <laughs> that was terrible lighting, but I just couldn't. I was like trying to think of a cool way, but I can't. <laughs> Dude. That's why I was trying to find the freaking camera stand. <laughs> I can't find it. Can't see it. Too oh. late. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Are you terrified? Yes, are you? I'm terrified. <laughs> enjoyed that um so we just want to close out the video and <laughs> you smell like me yes you smell like teen <laughs> spirit just, <laughs> just want to let you guys know that from here on out like there's no more secrets which is really nice because i feel like i was you trying to hide it, it and hold it in but like a lot of you guys actually Notice. Notice. Some Jedi communication. <laughs> yeah. That you Girls really know. Do. Thank you so much for supporting my channel. And um, I'm going to start like a whole pregnancy series. I'm going to talk to you guys about like how I stay fit during pregnancy, um, what kind of things I eat during pregnancy. It's probably going to be a crossover with the video I want to do about like eating clean. Um, and then, I think somebody asked you to do a video like that, right? Yeah. Somebody asked actually to do a video about like eating clean, like specifically like vegan meal replacement plant-based and all that good stuff so yeah, that will be help coming that, if, you, if you don't mind absolutely she does, we want to see more she actively him. doesn't put me <laughs> no, in the videos and no. i confront her about them like <laughs> do you want to look single no, no. <laughs> so lots of pregnancy content coming up lots of vlogs all that good stuff as always comment down below if you want to see a specific video thank you so much you guys for supporting me and I can't believe this year I reached a thousand subscribers. I'm yeah. hoping that it just continues to go up. Yeah, I just want to say thank you for me, for you guys supporting my baby. I really appreciate that. I know she deserves it. Um, and I want to be, I want to help. I want to be more active in this too, maybe yeah. in the f coming future. I know I have a lot of stuff, work, internship, school, but I still want to be a part of it. You know, I of course. Like, I feel like ideally contribute. in a perfect world, like we would like just record everything, you know, and like we have so many cool different aspects, I feel like of our life that would be like yeah. potentially interesting to people, but yeah. we are literally so busy and we're about to become busier with a new baby, but 
we're gonna do our best and good problems good problems good problems anyways you guys we love you we'll see you in the next video